Hi guys, so I'm going to do a few videos on our Athlete Market channel just to show you some of the stuff that we get up to in our downtime, which is very little of it at the moment, um, as anyone starting a small business will know, but I thought it just might be a little bit interesting for people. Uh, so um, I'm going to do a video in a few parts of a wooden gazebo that we've put up um, at the Stroud household. Uh, and hopefully you'll enjoy that. So um, yeah, let us know. Um, and if you do, please uh, like and subscribe to the channel. Cheers, guys. Enjoy. So here's the delivery arrived in the garden. We're just going to move it round to the back. So this is the, the beginning part of the build. Lola, there you come. Um, we've got the, the wood all bought round from the delivery in the week. Um, and we've got this weekend to get it up. So um, over in the evenings, I've been preparing the molds with Carly to make sure that we've got the, the molds ready for the concrete footings. Um, so we're gonna get them in first. Um, they'll be ready then for tomorrow for us to then start taking the wood out from underneath there um, and erecting the gazebo. Um, so, so far I've been really easy. Delivery was great from Dunster House. A um, couple of guys that, that dropped it off, um, unloaded it all into the front garden, which is cool. We then brought it round to the back here. Um, got to move this shed here. Um, so that's the bike shed. You can see that's got, to, that's got to be moved. Yeah, as you can see, this is the bike shed. Small, not in the best of shape, but got some cool artwork on it from Harry, who done some spray painting with his girlfriend Shanice over the uh, initial lockdown. Let me keep the doors closed so you can see what that's supposed to be. Disney's up. Um, and this is where we're gonna be putting it in. This used to have trampoline in the way and used to be where the dog used to come and hide everything underneath the trampoline after she'd chewed it up. As you can see, we've got to come away a little bit from the wall. So coming away from the wall and slightly from the decking as well. Um, for two reasons, obviously you can see the concrete there, which is gonna be the same on all the posts as we go down, um, but also as well, so we can get between it if we wanna do any repairs um, and when we wanna fix the side walls on it. There you go, very simple little molds there for the concrete posts. They're gonna go slightly in the ground. That's the shed moved, a bit easier than we thought. Repacking. But yeah, so I mean, it's not a, not a work of art. We're not gonna get into any galleries with it. But guess what? You don't have to store bikes in works of art. True fact. So ready to start the build um, and it's decided to be a wet rainy day so really happy with that. Just checking out the concrete post we put in. Yeah you checking them out as well Lola? How do they look? Right, that one's doing all right. Yeah I think we're good. Looks like we're good. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Bit of a wet, drizzly one today. Um, wearing a jacket that I've owned for probably 22 years. Um, been up the mountains in this quite a few times. May have saved my life. I don't know really, but let's just say that because it sounds really dramatic. Here's the wood unveiled. Lovely looking bits of timber. Yeah, beautiful. So now just gonna separate it out into the correct pieces so we can begin the project. Project starts with, as you can imagine, the six posts that support the beams. And then we begin from there. Thanks. 
So she's checking her list. She's checking it twice. She's going to find out if everything was delivered right. Wooden gazebo's coming to town. Boom, boom, boom. Wooden gazebo's coming to measure. town. Tape measure. Got it. Look at this. We've made a Christmas tree. Part of you thinks, do we just paint it and leave it in the garden for the kids? Or try and stand it up? Some huge monument. The other part of you says, of course not, you damn fool. We'll just crack on. What? And not tick them off? <laughs> Are you hearing this? That's sort of something I would say. Say it again for the camera, make sure I've got it. <laughs> Shall we crack on? <laughs> I love it. 